Matt Lenahan for Boxing Social in association with William Hill and Empire Fight, so I'm delighted to be joined by Dimitri Bivol. Dimitri, first off, congratulations, you won Fighter of the Year, you came to New York to pick it up. How pleased are you that you won Fighter of the Year? I'm so much happy, to be honest. I didn't expect that last year that uh, one day I could be the Fighter of the Year. And now I am... Uh, when I was a kid, I, w I watched a lot of uh, fights and I had my uh, favorite fighters like Sugar Ray Leonard, Muhammad Ali, uh, Roy Jones, uh, Manny Pacquiao and all of these fights had the award as a fighter of the year and now I am fighter of the year. Of course, how I should feel myself. I'm proud of myself. I'm proud of my team. Last time we spoke, you were having, obviously, you're having this extended period outside of the ring. Have you enjoyed relaxing and maybe not being in training camp for a fight? Yeah, to be honest, I was enjoying. Yeah, uh, I, I like uh, my positions now. I like. Uh, I was enjoying. I, I, I just, uh, I just love the life, you know, and I'm enjoying all, all moments. Right, let's get into it. I know you've asked, answered so many questions about Canelo Alvarez, I bet we've, we've all got to ask you. Um, where, where, where are we at now? Has there been any contact with Canelo's team about any negotiation for this rematch? Where are we, where are we at with it? We are nowhere with, <laughs> with the fight against Canelo, to be honest. <laughs> and this is why I don't like to talk about it. I think about my own way, you know, and he talks about I want to re rematch, rematch, okay, you want to rematch, uh, and you do nothing for, for this rematch. Why do you think he doesn't want to fight at his own weight against you and defend his belts? I don't know why, I don't know why, maybe because it's... Uh, uh, he want to just try again, he, wa he want to just take another sh chance to get my belt but he's uh, he doesn't want to risk his belt because it's his, it's a risk for him he doesn't want to fight at either weight class not yeah. even a, not because even he, knows a he will lose that's the answer because if he wanted to fight him at any weight class we would be talking right now about the fight and Eddie Reynoso wouldn't be talking to Charlo, Benavides, you know going all over other promoters if the Bivol fight was the fight that they wanted like they say they do they would only be focused on that fight. They're focused on other fights. They're looking around, they're searching around. They had two other fights before this. So they know they lost, and they know they lost most rounds. They try to say that it was the hand, or maybe they said that they needed a couple of rounds to win, but at the end of the day, they know they lost the fight heavily. Just like he lost the Mayweather fight, and he never took the rematch. He never did the rematch, same thing here. So that's the answer. They don't so, want the fight. So they don't want the fight either way, but would you be willing to fight at the same way as the last fight, or not? Is that completely off the table? 175, ты бы согласился? It's just a small chance to me fight against him and 175. Only if I don't have any other options. Just zero. How important is legacy to you? Obviously the Canelo Alvarez fight makes you a lot of money. How important is your legacy in boxing? Uh, of course we are here to to we are building our legacy. Every athlete uh, building our le own legacy, of course, me too, it's very important. Do you believe that he is ducking you? I don't like this word, you know. Uh, I don't know how to say it on English, but uh, I think he, he prefers to fight against another people. Bob Arum has come out and said that they will not pursue a fight between um, Better Beer and yourself because of obviously everything that's going on between Ukraine and Russia. Does that disappoint you, the fact that they won't go down that road and try and make that fight? I don't see that it's the biggest problem between our fight that uh, people doesn't want to make it because of because of this, I, I see there is some another uh, another problems here yeah, to make this fight. Or the fight hasn't happened before this anyway. You know, with all the respect to Bob and uh, to Mauricio, they're trying to mix politics into this situation. It's really not about politics. If the fight, you'll see the fight will happen, and if it happens, 
like if it, if it doesn't happen, it won't be because of this. I can tell you that for sure. Better be versus Callum Smith. Obviously, you'll have a close eye on that fight. Who do you think wins that fight, and why? Interesting fight. Uh, interesting because uh, Callum Smith is younger than Better be and he's tall. Uh, he has a good left hook, but Better be still stronger, still strong and stronger than uh, Smith and. Uh, and he's more skillful. Do you have a preference on who you want to win that fight, or does it not matter to you? Anyone with a belt? Doesn't matter. To be honest, doesn't matter who wins. Just, just want to fight against the winner of this fight. When can we expect to see you back in the ring? If it's not against Canelo, if it's not against Betabiev, when can we see you back in the ring? Because you want to get active again. When will you see you in the ring, if it's not Canelo or Betabiev? I hope uh, in uh, October, maybe September, uh, yeah, September, October, uh, I would like to fight, of course. Yeah. Okay. Well, last one for me. Have you got a message to your fans, the ones who support you and get behind you? Yeah, if I have a chance, of course, I will <laughs> take this chance. Uh, thank you, everyone who's supporting me, and uh, congratulations all my people who support me that we got the award as a fighter of the year. and. Uh, I'm so glad and just uh, don't just uh, cheering for me from the sofa. Take some time and go to the gym and practicing with with the boxing gym in the boxing gym. Well, Dimitri Bivol, thanks for talking to Boxing Social. We hope you get back in the ring soon and we'll catch up on your next fight week. Thank you.